Hi everyone, this is Miss Issa and I work in the Greater Valley YMCA and today we're going to be working with sorting M&Ms and also charting them, okay? So who doesn't like M&Ms, right? Um, we are going to be sorting peanut M&Ms. Um, if you're working with kids, you want to make sure that they're not allergic, so it's best to just get regular M&Ms. Or if you want to um, use a different type of candy, it works fine too. So um, we're going to be sorting them out and then we're going to be charting them in this um, graph. Okay, so <clears throat> sorting. I notice that I have an orange one I have another one here some over here so I'm gonna separate them sorting is separating okay I am sorting this brown ones down here the yellow ones here okay and the green ones here and then the blue ones here Right now, when it comes to graphing or charting, we are going to look at the graph. The bottom has the colors, okay? So we have red, green, yellow, blue, orange, and brown. And this side is the number of M&Ms, okay? And depending on what number, of M&Ms we have, that's where we're going to color up to, okay? So let's look at the brown. Brown is first. So we're going to start off with counting the browns. There's one and two. So number two. Some kids might not know or um, be able to identify the number, so that they might need a little help. You can start with zero one and two so we're gonna color right here okay I'll color here that's brown the color that is next is orange so let's go see what how many of orange M&Ms we have so one and since these are like they're round so you might um, want to help your child count to you or you can help have them actually start counting with their fingers so that way they can actually remember where they stopped or where they um, they started um, and not or count. So one, two, three, and four. So come back here and we count how many squares. One, two, three, and four. So we're gonna count this line or color to this line. Okay. So we're gonna color this. And you can see, you can start telling or um, helping your child say, oh, which color has the most or which one is the tallest or the biggest from this two. And you can say oranges and then the brown one has less than the orange. Work on the, the, um, the less and the more. All right. The next one is blue. So we're going to go the blue M&Ms. So we have one, two, three, four, five. Five. So we're going to do one, two, three, four, and five. You can see that there's number five right here. Here. We start coloring. Two. Three, and this helps too with counting. 
get better at it. So now you can point out, oh, I noticed that the blue has one more square than the orange. Or you can say, I noticed that the orange has one, two more than the brown. Okay. The next color is yellow. So why don't we go see yellow? So you say one, two, three, four. Four. So let's do one, two, three, four. Okay, and then we color them. One, two, three, and four. Hmm. Now let's take a look at the graph. You can wait till the end for all the colors to be there, or you can just start saying, oh, what do you notice about the graph? And you can say, or help your child say, I noticed that the orange and the yellow line up to each other, so that may mean that they have the same amount. So let's count. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. You're right, orange and yellow have the same amount, okay? The next color is green. Let's count the green. One, two, and three. Let's do three. So one, two, and three. Now your kids might wanna not do this and just start eating the m and So you can say, well, let's do this and you will get the m and okay? Now the next one, oh, and then you can start saying, noticing the graph, like I said. You can wait till the end. Um, now let's do red. And we don't have red, so that, it's just gonna stay like that. And now you can say, hmm, what do you notice about this chart? It's very colorful. But you can say, or help your child say, blue one is the tallest. So I wonder if that color has the most, or more than the other colors, okay? Say one, two, three, four, five, and you can count them all and say, you're right, blue has the most. Which color has less or the least? Some kids might just look at the colors here and say brown has the least or has less than the rest, which true from this colors. But from the whole entire color chart, would say red has none, zero, okay? It has less, say brown or red. If you wanna help your child or pra practice with their numbers, you can actually have them write the number at the top. Okay, so brown. One, two. This one has two. One, two, three, four. And this one has four. One, two, three, four, five. Five. One, two, three, four. Four. One, two, three. And this is zero. And then they can actually say four and four are the same number. So those two are the same, okay? And then you get to enjoy the M&Ms. Okay, actually have your child count all the M&Ms, okay? So why don't we do that? And then that will be it. You ready? So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. That's a lot of counting. Ten, 
11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, and 18. 18 M&Ms. It's a lot. Okay. And 18 looks like this. It's a one first and a number eight. That's number 18. Enjoy.